Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros, welcome to the 320th episode of Potty Talk Live. I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, where we're talking the business of plumbing, how to systemize, stylize, and most importantly, monetize your plumbing business. All right, hey, been looking forward to this episode. We got a great one here. I, I know, know I, right? I know I always say that, but I am. We, we're continuing our five-part hey, series Mikey. on living an intentional life. Mm -hmm. And the title of this episode is Always Be Growing. All right, how, how do you take your life, your business to the ne next level? How next do you level, level up? So we're going to mm -hmm. go over that here in just a little bit here. But great to have you here on board. Yeah. Already I can see people checking in. Hey, mm -hmm. if you're watching live with mm -hmm. us, you're part of the live social audience, type live in the comments. Mm -hmm. Let us know you're here. Hey, man, All right. Dave. Good to see you, brother. Mm -hmm. And if you're watching the replay, please type replay to let us know that you caught it. Mm -hmm. All right. And if you're listening to the podcast, you know what to do. Just mm -hmm. keep on listening. Who's that? All right. Mr. Basinga's in the house. I used to know someone by the I name know. of Where, Patrick where, where, When was that? Did we know that? Ought something. I know. He's kind of been, been, right. Yeah. I miss you, brother. We All right. Hope Patrick. you're doing well. It's good to see you. Yeah. All right. Okay. You had a great fourth with your family. Hey, Aaron. Mr. Sylvia. Mm -hmm. How you doing, brother? Yes. Hope everyone had a great fourth of July. Oops, yes. All right. Had some family time. Mm -hmm. All right. And, uh, Fireworks. And got to hang out a little bit. Mm -hmm. All right. Eat some fun food. Yeah, do some fireworks. Mm -hmm. All right. We celebrated independence. Yeah. Maybe. I saw fireworks. So <laughs> if you want to sign up for text messages and never miss an episode, <laughs> never miss when we go live, type text in the comments. That's right. Right now, and you'll get notified every time we go never wanna live. Never want to miss an episode of Potty Talk Live Don't or I'm what? going to die. You're going to die. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey. Hey, good to see Sarah, you. Hello, right back Sarah at you. Sarah and uh, Mickey. All right. Of, ooh, why can't I remember? Another Sarah. Sarah. Coming Express. Miss, yeah, I think that's it. I'm sorry, guys. Hey, Sarah right. Delaney, how's good, it going? Good to have you here live. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, yeah, so today. Today, what? We went and visited some clients that are down in Florida. Down vacationing, vacationing here with their family. Florida. Just What's came because like? there was a hurricane headed our way. Right. So. <laughs> Hurricanes seem to chase them, <laughs> follow them. they were in Cancun with us yes. when, when yeah, we went when through we that went uh, through with through the group that. with the hurricane. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, so it was fun. We got to go yeah. to St. Pete. Beautiful day. It was gorgeous out. I don't know, yes. Calm before the storm or Had something. Had fun hanging out with them. Mm -hmm. Love got to Beautiful hang out, uh, meet the kids, mm -hmm. and and uh, brought mom down too, grandma. Yep. And... Uh, so that's fun. Carter's. Got to hang out. Yeah. All, All right. I'm seeing these guys. Loved it. So, yes, but it was a gorgeous day. We are supposed to be oh. getting a tropical storm. I don't think it's gone hurricane anymore. Uh, well, right. I don't know. We're all going to die. Well, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you listen, you watch the news. We're all uh, going to die. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> but we did. Mm -hmm. It was beautiful all day. Thank you. Here we go. Sorry. Uh, Coming out, we did have some rain come through. It's, it's beautiful right now. Mm -hmm. But I think we're going to get some rain tomorrow. I mean, yeah. you know, this time of year, storms happen. Right. I always get that. You know, <laughs> we moved to Florida. <laughs> right. And, you know. We should be expecting right storms sort of, happen. I mean, it's kind yeah. of hurt, you know, mm -hmm. tropical storms and that kind of stuff. Right, it's like when winter rolls around, it's like the weathermen are like, it's going to be bitterly right. cold. Well, well, no kidding, no kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I live in Indiana, right? Of course, it's going to be Get cold. ready to die. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so, but anyway, so, yeah, they, they it's they're everywhere. Down it's everywhere. Yes, it's everywhere. So, but yeah, so they're down. Hopefully, just have a one day of a tropical yeah, storm tomorrow, and then. Yeah, and back. Well, we see. That looks like it's going to be sunny again. Mm -hmm. So it'll just roll on through. Um, All right. Aaron says, oh, just <laughs> just confused. <laughs> no, just finished module twelve. Just confused. Why <laughs> didn't see okay. class at Taco Bell? <laughs> Probably a good one. We should. No. We're always Aaron. adding. We're always adding to the academy. <laughs> no. So you did trying... twelve really, Aaron. All right. Good for You've you, brother. For a year. Good for you. Yeah, that's exciting. You okay. know the next step, right? Yeah. Just saying. All right. you know the next step. Okay, who's right. ever throwing love bomb? Thanks, you, thank you guys so yeah. much. Love that. Because right now I'm looking at um, the Facebook, and Facebook is just going through some weird changes, and so it doesn't offer you up as much unless you get comments and likes and things like right. that. So just so help us get this out to ding, others. Ding, ding. Appreciate yes. it. If mm -hmm. you show us some love, yes. give us some love bombs, mm -hmm. and uh, share this. Even if you hate right. us, go ahead and right. throw a hate right. bomb. Right. I don't care. Yeah, give us a finger. Care. I don't care. <laughs> I'd okay. rather you not do that, exactly. <laughs> anyway, go back to Aaron. Well, Aaron give us the poop emoji. The poop emoji. What? <laughs> I don't want the poop emoji. Um, Aaron, congratulations. Yes. Getting through. Yes, next step. You know what that is. 
um, yep. getting through um, a, the Success Academy. And, st and sticking with and it. And sticking with it. Good for you. Wait, right. Yeah. And I'd be interested in, in what you thought of, of Module 12. Yes. Yeah. That was our favorite, mm -hmm. obviously, once you get into Module 12. Because ultimately, that, that's what <laughs> having this, this business is all about, mm -hmm. at least in, in our, our point of view. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know. And it, what it's, we teach. Right. Well, there's more than one way to do it. Right. right? But so. it's but it's to create that that freedom lifestyle. Mm -hmm. All right, so you can. In fact, we talked a little bit about the, not today with with mm -hmm. the Carters. I yes. mean, they're got. I mean, they're 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 killing it. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're killing. Like I mean, they said they can't believe it was ever they would ever have this. And, yeah. And it's what to do. You know, you just take your life. It's a different way of looking at life, mm -hmm. and you, you go into another level. Right. Okay. Yep. And um, mm -hmm. and that's what Module Twelve is all about. Right. Which was a lot of fun because okay. we shot it. Um, for those of you who don't know, we shot Module 12 um, on different all on site, or not on site, on, on location. Right, as we traveled to different things and yeah. did, and that, that was a fun one. Yeah. Was, we, we spoke about the different things to, mm -hmm. to create more time and, right. in life and that kind of thing. Right. A, um, 12 good, rest was a beating, right. yeah, sorry. Right. <laughs> it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be hard. Right. <laughs> the rest of them were a beating, yes. especially three, we know that. Yes. But you got through it, so That's good right, for you, good for you, man. Love that. And way yes, to stick with it. All step. right, that's what winners do. By the way. All mm -hmm. right. Hey, but we're going to be talking about <laughs> always be growing. Always be and growing. And Aaron, that is part of it. it the mm -hmm. growing never stops. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we never... Winners don't stop growing, right. okay? Mm -hmm. and, and so you're we're always going to be looking about, you know, growing. Mm -hmm. So there is, there's always a next step. We're, we're, there's right. never a finish line for right. winners, mm -hmm. okay? Yes. And, um, and so that's what we're going to be talking about we today. Question. What? We have, we have a question. question. What? We have a question. What's our question? What's the question? What's the last book you mm -hmm. read or listened to? Mm -hmm. What's last the book? last book, all right, that you read? Yes. Or that you listened to? Listening now, is kind of, because we have yeah, audio books now. Yes. That, that kind of I thing. Love all right? Books. Yes. I okay. multitask. Yes. I love that. I know. You like the mm -hmm. audio books tend to, well, I did it when I was in the truck. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. I was, Plus uh, more CDs. <laughs> well, was C, that's right. They were like, no. Eight track, <laughs> no, track tapes. No, I think eight track tapes. I'm pretty sure it might have been. Does anybody CDs. remember eight track tapes? Do I have any of my the old cats? They even know what that is. Okay. Okay. Clunk, clunk, clunk. clunk, clunk, clunk. clunk. I know when it switches. <laughs> All right. But you were saying you prefer. I, I remember my first. Oh, okay. My first eight track tape, and I thought it was so cool. How in the world? It was BTO, Bachman, Bachman Turner, Turner Overdrive. Overdrive. <laughs> <laughs> Stars. <laughs> They're probably doing some <laughs> concert, you know. Yeah, I think. <laughs> What do you call right. it? Like the casino round or yeah, something? Yeah, right, the casino, right. You <laughs> Rich know. Dad, Poor Dad, Sarah Donne says. Oh, yes. That's a great that is a book. Great book. For um, you guys watching <sighs> right. Potty Talk Live. Even just getting the idea of thinking. There's a mm -hmm. difference between how we've been raised to think. Mm -hmm. And you know, he says the poor dad, but it could be middle class dad. Right. You know, mm -hmm. what, what it is. And that, that's, you know, put the mask on, get, get the safe job, <laughs> you know, plan for retirement, that kind of stuff. Rich Dad doesn't think that way. Rich Dad does not think that way. No. Rich Dad thinks totally different. Yes. And so it's by Robert Kiyosaki. Right. Um, so, yeah, that's and that's an easy read, too, guys. But right. anybody watching this that owns a plumbing business, if you haven't read Rich Dad, Poor Dad, you definitely need to do that. You had the carrying so, case for the 8-tracks? <laughs> All right. You had the carrying case for the 8-tracks. Yeah, it was, you know, that, that fake brown leather. Leather. Or, yeah, leather. leather. <laughs> right. right. With the little uh, chrome clip. You know, that's right. Took up the entire seat. Right. Oh, see, my Mikey gets it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I pulled uh, it out of my, you know, drive, <laughs> driving around in my 1974 <laughs> Galaxy <laughs> station wagon. <laughs> All right, with my 8-track tape player. Hi, Joe. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you need to tell your... Um, your uh, Domino's Pizza story sometime. I really? am. Right. <laughs> okay, I'll that. lose all self-respect. <laughs> or not, I, no, I, or respect, uh, or whatever respect whatever. I have out there. <laughs> <laughs> it is a great story. Just saying. Okay, anyway. all right. All right, so what are so we what's the last about? book? Oh, well, last we see book, yeah. Some, yeah. We saw some. Rich Dad, okay. Poor Dad. If you're not reading, well, well, we'll get to that. We are going to okay. talk about books. All right, but mm -hmm. we're going to talk about books. But yeah. let's talk about always always growing, mm -hmm. okay? Always Always want to be growing. Always, always want to be leveling up. So what do we need to do? Number one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Number one. All right. What? Keep moving forward. Okay. Keep. That's a. I you know, my clients get mm. probably get sick of me saying that. <laughs> fall forward. But it's but fall it, forward. let's fall forward. Mm -hmm. But it's you know you fall. <laughs> so even if you're falling, we want to we want to fall we want to fall forward, mm -hmm. not fall back. Mm -hmm. Okay. But you got to keep moving. You got to keep moving forward. Okay. You what gotta, do you mean Got to keep moving. Okay? okay. And it's it's a mindset. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the mindset is is that I'm. I'm busy living, mm -hmm. 
Okay. Sadly, most people, and we're also conditioned the way that we're getting busy, that we're busy dying. Mm -hmm. Dust the mask, but we're busy dying. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so, but so this is a mindset. Mm -hmm. And part of that mindset, there is no retirement. No such thing. That's a lie. That that Mm -hmm. is something that's been designed to keep us, keep you from moving forward, to get in line. Mm -hmm. Okay. And be everybody's, you know, little Um, whatever. What? I don't care. Okay. okay. I mean, (laughs) Oh okay, my but that's that's how powerful this stuff is. <laughs> mm-hmm. You got it. But this is the mindset of keep moving forward. We're not right. retiring. There's no such thing as retiring. Mm-hmm. So even even when you grow this, you know, Aaron, you grow your plumbing business, mm-hmm. and you know you made it. You've gone through the academy. It's moving forward. You learn something new. Mm-hmm. You know, put these things in play. You're going to grow your business. Just just like we talked with the Carters. Mm-hmm. I mean, I mean, they're killing it. Mm-hmm. I mean, they are. with within a year, they're, they've been pushing a four million dollar company. Mm-hmm. Yeah. From just do, doing what they learned in the academy, I got to say, private coaching, okay, okay. right? <laughs> um, but it's but it's doing that thing. So mm-hmm. what's the next to keep moving forward? What's the thing? You, right. you just don't sit back, right? Okay, because if, if you coasting, sit back, you're coasting downhill, right? Okay, you're busy mm-hmm. dying, right. okay. So what's we're not. That, what movie is that from? Busy living, get busy living, or get uh, busy Shawshank dying? Redemption. That's right, Shawshank Redemption, great movie. Good, good movie, mm-hmm. right? All right. So okay. you know, busy living Sorry. or busy dying, because mm-hmm. you only have one life to live. That's true. And everyone saves it, you know, we're being conditioned to save it for the end. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, I'll retire, retire at 65. <laughs> when I'm 70, I'll retire. <laughs> right. Your body hurts at that age. We're, oh. we're getting close to that, and we can attest. Right. Why in the world would you wait to start living until you're, you're 60? 70, right. And you're, and you're not. The problem right. is, is you don't, mm. you know. Mm-mm. And and again, I can't stress even the, the mind. It's, it's a mindset thing. I mean, we have a great example here. Okay. I mean, we're pushing 60. And we live in a community, mm-hmm. though it's nice. I want to say so. People have been successful. Sure. There's because it's nice, it's, right? To where we're at, cold it's, weather. Right. Places, it takes right? something to ha- you must mm-hmm. have created something to mm-hmm. be here. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. But we don't hang out with these people because they're busy dying. Mm-hmm. They spend in the, the mindset is okay. I've now I've retired. Retired. And so what I start. That's where we have we have you know we have the pool Nazi, you know <laughs> we we, we have the lawn Nazi. Nazi. <laughs> We we got all these Karens and Carls <laughs> that are just you know, this isn't right, this isn't right. Because that's all they're focused on. Right, right. Because because they're not right. They're not they're not growing. They're not living. Right. They're, they're getting ready to die mm. just in a nice place. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Great view. right. You know. So you know we don't we don't even work out mm. with. I, I mean they have a, we have a real nice facility here. Mm-hmm. Really nice. Mm-hmm. We don't work out there anymore. Right. Because we we'll get that. But because they're busy dying. Mm-hmm. You, know, you don't don't want to be around that. Mm-hmm. Okay? okay. So you got to have a purpose. I mean, so we're always keeping another purpose. So you finish the academy. What are you going to do with that? With that, okay? Mm-hmm. Your business gets to a certain point. What you know? What, what are you going to do with that? Right. What, what, what are you moving towards? Mm-hmm. In fact, as you get older, there's the thing with retirement. Mm-hmm. You know, studies have shown that those who continue to work live longer. Yes. Hey. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, hey, there's thanks. the Carter. Oh, thanks for inviting us over. Yeah, it was great Saying thanks. out with you guys today, and they Matt. With, with little, uh, <laughs> little doll baby right there. <laughs> She's a cutie. She's such a cutie. And Cameron, mm-hmm. their son. Mm-hmm. I mean, he's a good-looking kid. Mm-hmm. He's, a, he's a quarterback. Mm-hmm. Well, he's going to be a killer. He's going to be a killer. <laughs> be a killer. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Get ready. Right, there we go. GB, that's hey, right. GB. We're still going strong. Yeah, there we go. Are. Great example. GB. They're busy living, mm-hmm. okay? You know, it's taking the hits and just, you know, and still. And he's not a spring chicken. No. GB would not mind me Move, saying that. Moving forward, okay? Because, mm-hmm. you know, studies have shown those that continue working mm-hmm. live longer. Right. You know, you stop having something to work, you know, live for. Right. And work, you know, mm-hmm. you just, we, we, we were created to be moving forward. Mm-hmm. We were created to create. Mm-hmm. We were created to work, okay? Mm-hmm. So this whole idea of retiring. Is dumb. that kind of a thing? Okay. Dumb. So you got got that end of it, mm-hmm. and then also as you're working on your business and things, you just got to keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Keep, keep moving growing. forward. Don't keep, get stagnant. Don't. All right. Right. Okay. There so we that's go. Point one. Keep okay. moving forward. That makes sense. Yeah, that makes that sense. Makes sense? Okay. All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Point mindset. Two. Mindset. Eighty percent of your success is up here. Yep. Yeah. It's just. In that small space. It, it's up, up here. Right. Right up here. Okay. Number two. And we kind of talked about this. We yes. came off our question here. Mm-hmm. Leaders are readers. Mm-hmm. Leaders are readers. To grow, okay, and to be a, you know, a, to be a leader, mm-hmm. okay, and leaders grow. Everyone else doesn't, mm-hmm. okay? All right? But it's, you got you to gotta read, mm-hmm. okay, to grow. And I just leading keeps... or leading. Reading is reading a book or listening. Right. Both. Either okay. 
but mm-hmm. but it's it's putting new stuff up here right. and good stuff. Okay. Right. All right. So you know, good good books, good mm-hmm. audio. We just mentioned a couple couple of rich, rich, rich dad poor dad. Mm-hmm. Okay. Think and uh, grow rich. Think and grow rich is a great book. David said, just started my business four months ago. Got tired of making other people rich. That's right. That's right. Mm-hmm. Do you want to be rich, David? Do you think you're worth it? Mm-hmm. That's, I'm going to. I'm you, challenging you, David. Do you think you're worth it? Mm-hmm. Okay. So that will determine a lot about what you're, you know, who you work for and what mm-hmm. you charge. Yes. Okay. Because you're probably not charging enough. Right. Just you don't, saying. Because <laughs> you don't think you're worth it. I mean, mm-hmm. I'm cutting to the chase. Mm-hmm. But I'm glad you started your business. Yes, congratulations. Okay, a good, book, the ring. a good book for you to read is called The E-Myth. Okay? Yes, The E-Myth, The Entrepreneurial what, Myth. The Entrepreneur E-Myth, myth by right. um, a Ger- um, um, Gerber, Michael Gerber. Michael Gerber, yes. right. Great Where, book. Easy because book it's, it's the trap. Mm-hmm. 95% of all plumbing businesses fail. Mm-hmm. And part of it, a large part of it is because it's E-Myth, meaning I'm good at plumbing. Mm-hmm. Okay? Great at plumbing. Great at plumbing. So instead of making that guy a lot of my money, which I'm going to make money for. I'm going to make me rich. That's right. But we get in and find out it has nothing to do with plumbing. <laughs> nothing. David, I'm going to tell Zero. you, your business has Zip. nothing. Your success Nada. has nothing to do. <laughs> it don't care how good of a plumber you are. It has it nothing don't. to do with plumbing. Mm-hmm. Okay? <laughs> it's about the business. Mm-hmm. Okay? About these other things. Yes. Okay? Mm-hmm. The value you're able to provide. Those yes. kinds of things. And so... That's the that's the e myth. So, yes. the, you know, these examples a lot of you know a good baker, mm-hmm. you know, makes the best cupcakes in town. Right. And starts, starts a cupcake shop. Goes out of business. Yeah, because you she know, has no idea. The trades, right? The trades are a perfect example. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, you know, we see it all the time again with plumbers. Ninety five percent of all plumbing businesses fail. Mm-hmm. Okay, within the first three years. Hey, David, how do you, how have you determined what your hourly rate should be? Yeah. I'd be interested in hearing that. Aaron, you want to tell him? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Aaron, you're still watching. <laughs> All right. Okay. Because it's not enough. I right. guarantee you it's right. not enough. <laughs> tell him what he's really selling and it ain't plumbing. It's not plumbing. All right. David, shocker, it's not plumbing. You're not selling plumbing. Also, okay, I got yes. down here, sweetheart, what? about listening to like podcasts. Yes. You know, in the, the truck, instead of listening to news or sports, stop or the sports, the whatever. sports news, and in the political news, mm, and the no, cra- it's, it's that not, does stop, nothing stop. to move you forward, Mm-mm. guys. It does not. Okay, it moves other people forward. Right. All right. Stop. Stop being the, uh, you know, stop being their whatever. Okay. Their whatever. The little be- yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh my okay. And that's a, that's what you are. If mm-hmm. you're listening to the sports stuff. <laughs> And the political news mm. and all that, yeah. you're you're just there, whatever. Mm. Okay, that does that does nothing for you. Okay, mm. listen to things that open your mind and, and show you what can be, mm. and listen listen from others. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. Um, yes, you do need to join the academy. It is self-serving, David. <laughs> I mean, but you do. There's a 14-day free trial. That's right. Type success in the comments right okay. now, and you'll get all the information. Yes. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm dropping gold, picking it up. Matt Dell, okay. you picked up a lot of gold, Matt Dell. Yeah, you're doing it. <laughs> the 14 day free trial. Yeah, Aaron. Aaron, Aaron I hooked you, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> it is a. Not I'll be, be straightforward. have a method to our madness. Hey, well, I know. Hey, I don't trust. I, I know. I, hey, I'm a plumber. I get it. You know, who is this joker? This is yeah, I don't want to do. All right, what am I getting into here? And so I make it easy for you, David. I have a 14 no, day free not, trial. David, not probably. You're yeah. not. You're right. not doing it. I promise right. you, you're not. <laughs> all right, and it's Guys, all right. Tell him. We tell know. him you've all of us there. Didn't. Okay. Matt Delnay is a perfect example. Aaron, oh. I'm sure you are too. Um, GB, I mean, everybody that's, right. that's um, either through private coaching or Success Academy. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell you. You're not doing it right, but it's not your fault. Yep. So it will be your fault if you don't make a change. So if, if you truly want to be successful. Exactly. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, but, so look, listen to the podcast. The podcast. Yes, the podcast. one great podcast to listen to. Um, one of our favorites is um, E on Fire, Entrepreneurs yeah. on Fire. Now, it's not about plumbing. It's it's not about um, – you may not be totally interested in every one of the subjects, but you always get like a little like nugget. A, right. And the, the interviewer, his name's John JLD, John Lee Dumas. Right. He interviews business entrepreneurs from all over in all different walks of industry and life and, and um, successful um, business owners who have normally gone through some really hard right. times and then come out of it. Um, but you always get a little nugget, and they're short. They're like you know, 25, 30, minute, um, 30 minutes long. They're a great podcast right. to listen to, and Entrepreneur on Fire. In fact, in the early days, mm-hmm. you know, that, that helped us learn yes. some you know, business, business, mm-hmm. business concepts. Because we, you'll, you'll get a nugget, and then you'll start to drill down on, okay, what did he mean by that? What, what, what well, is that? Yeah, what oh, yeah. is that that he's talking about? And then you go and you know, search. And How would some, I do that? Oh, yeah. my, my, my business needs that. Right. That that kind of a yes. thing. So there's always a nugget you can And so up. that's that's how you need to listen. <laughs> yes. Okay. That's how you need to listen. Not not well this well, has nothing to do with, do with plumbing, plumbing business, so I'm out. 
Right. No, don't do not do that. Business is business. Right. Business is business. That's right, sweetheart. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Business is business mm-hmm. across, across, the board, across the board. Okay? Yes. You know, the equations work the same. Mm-hmm. Ideas work the same. Customers yep. are customers. The podcast. What was the podcast? Entrepreneur on, on Fire. Fire. E on Fire is also has known the um the host name is jld john lee dumas you listen listen yes. to it richard, richard was actually interviewed on entrepreneur on fire what babe three years ago yeah was a long time ago yeah um yes you're right gb yeah. right was yeah. it three years ago yeah yeah uh, three mm-hmm. years ago yeah, yeah. million dollar plumber yeah. So, right. Anyway, um, so that was the podcast. What's um another uh, podcast? I like Ed Milet. Ed Milet. Ed Milet, and I just um, you know, there's all kinds of good voices out there, mm-hmm. um, but Ed Milet, M Y O L E T T. Yep. Ed mm-hmm. Milet, um, came from nothing. Mm-hmm. Um, now he's one of these guys. He, he has, he'll you can see his jet and cars, mm-hmm. couple houses, but he doesn't throw it out there so mm-hmm. much like a Grant Cardone. It's another one that you can watch or listen to. You um, can but take but, it. <laughs> but he's more salesy, more mm-hmm. and Grant is. Grant is. Yeah. I like Ed because um, he's 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 more mm-hmm. mindset. Right. Really. And he interviews guy all different kinds of people mm-hmm. and um, has been extremely successful mm-hmm. and um, he's a believer, mm-hmm. um, which I like. Mm-hmm. Um, and he's a you know he works out you can see you know he um, little, he's, he's into working out and mm-hmm. that kind of stuff. Yeah, he's definitely fit. Right, so sure. he's a fit guy. So I like that. <laughs> mm-hmm. And um, he always, you know, speaks well of his wife and mm-hmm. and family been and forever, right? right. Yep. Yeah. So, and yeah, uh, my kind of kind of story when they got the water shut off from their they had an apartment when he and his wife were first married, mm-hmm. and got their water shut off, and they'd go to the pool. You know, the, the apartment complex had a pool, mm-hmm. and they would shower there, mm-hmm. but they would walk this beach area and say, "One day I'm going to live up there." That's mm-hmm. one of the concepts for those that are looking. You want to be how the wealthy look different and things differently. Mm-hmm. You got to you got to picture yourself, and, right. and you got to go into these environments that mm-hmm. really you're uncomfortable with. Right. Like who am I to say that? I'm I'm going to live in a house like that. It overlooks the you know, Pacific, Pacific you know, that's a multi-gazillion dollar house. Right. All right. He now lives up on that cliff mm-hmm. in a multi-gazillion dollar house. Right. He saw But it. he made that decision when he had the water cut off. Mm-hmm. You know, <laughs> imagine that. Run down apartment. Right. Yeah. And that kind of a thing. Mm-hmm. And so that's, that's why I like him. So he's come, he's come from that. Yes. And he's gone all the way. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> right. But I like it, just like his mindset. Mm-hmm. And, um, a lot of mindset teaching. Right. So he's good. Gary Vaynerchuk is another. Gary V. Gary V. As he's known. Just a cool guy. I mean, he, he's, he's, he, he's salty. He's salty. <laughs> he likes to throw the F-bombs out every, every other, other, other word. word. I think that's, that's the only other word. I think he knows two words. <laughs> you know, whatever. And that's one of them. Yeah. <laughs> but, but he's a great marketer. No, great. Um, right. Yeah. And, and business guy, so right. he, he always has great nuggets as well. So but find things like that. That Tony Robbins is another. Um, just to listen to, just fill your mind with that kind of stuff, as opposed to the news, the sports, just even music to some degree. Sometimes you need a break and you just need to listen to whatever kind of music you really like. But right. for the most part, um, if you're wanting to grow your business and yourself, listen to these type of podcasts. Right. It it is the difference. It puts mm-hmm. it it. It feeds you, you know, in a different way, mm-hmm. as opposed to listening to the news. News of any kind, right. by the way. Which news of dying. any kind. Mm-hmm. Stop watching the news. If you're mm-hmm. serious about being successful, stop mm-hmm. watching yes. the news. Mm-hmm. Okay, stop being part of the cattle. Mm-hmm. Okay, common people watch the news. Right. Extraordinary people, difference makers, mm-hmm. watch the news. No, difference makers. I mean, um, make the news. Make the okay? news instead of watch DTH, the news. DTH, Plumbing and Septic, mm-hmm. David, all right. Okay. Change well, the name. Change your name, David. <laughs> okay. T- sorry, change it right now. Right, You're we'll get, we'll get right old. to it. I love you, brother. <laughs> I've never met you, but we're brothers. We're in plumbing. I get change it. I just it. want the best for you. Okay? All right? Free advice right there. We didn't okay. charge you a dime. Some of the yet. others speak up and tell yeah, them guys, why. Okay, who's okay. watching right now? Okay, right. Um, all right. Yeah, all you guys, you know. Yep. And, and just make it plumbing. Mm-hmm. Don't yes. make it septic and right. just, yeah, gutter plumbing. cleaning and right. whatever, okay? Yeah, just, just plumbing. Just, just plumbing. Yeah, where, where do you live, David? Where, where do you city? live, David? Because, yeah, that's part okay. of the academy, too. Act, Act as, as if. if. Yes. The movie Boiler Room. That's right. As if. Guys. Yes. Okay. As if it's already there. Speak it as if it already were. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's right. And that's also scriptural. Hey, yes, it is. Uh-huh. Right. Mm-hmm. Hey, David, I have yes. something for you here, mm-hmm. okay? And for others uh, being a part, uh, you know, here watching, mm-hmm. all right, it's my free... 
Million Dollar Plumber Blueprint. All right, David, these are the specs you got to have in place. You know, when you plumb a house, you know, you got the, the specs all in line so you know what, how to plumb the house. Mm-hmm. Well, these are the specs you need in place to build your plumbing business, all right? And I made it free to you, okay? It's, there's no strings attached to this free, <laughs> okay? All right, simply type free in the comments. Or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash free, mm-hmm. all right? Yes. And David, grab your copy. Yes, okay? and then change your name. Change the plumbing business and that's name part of it, right yeah. now. Okay. That has to be done. Yeah, David, where, where are you from? I can't yes. help it. Clover, Clover City, City. Or Clover, South Carolina. Okay. South Carolina. So what's, what's unique or what's something that, that means something in Clover? You mm-hmm. want to create an emotion, okay? Right. So it could be. If there's no Clover plumbing, it could be Clover plumbing. Right. Okay? Mm-hmm. But is there a landmark? Mm-hmm. You know, a mountain or I know, South Carolina, you know, uh, yeah. something that the, the town is known for. Mm-hmm. OK. Right. But you want to create emotion with your name to cut through the clutter. Right. Like um, clients of ours in Utah, um, they live in near. Oh, gosh, where do they live? It's near St. George, but right. maybe 30 minutes away. Um, they just named their um, company Iron Mountain Plumbing because all the iron, all the, the mountains around there have. Are, so it's red. Yeah, iron, kind it's of red, red, yeah, right. red clay. Right. So. Um, I'm trying to think of another one that named, um, oh, um, Babe Plumbing out yeah. of Mankato, Minnesota. Um, Babe the Blue Ox is in Paul Bunyan and the Blue Ox is right. the legendary, you know, from the legendary That's area. That's the area. Of, so if you know, your pa- like, right. yeah, Paul, Paul Bunyan and then Babe the Blue Ox. Mm-hmm. Well, they named their plumbing. Babe Plumbing. Babe Plumbing. Because it resonates right. with the community. Right. Right? So it's so, creating emotion. Right. It'd be more, I often will use on this kind of, I kind of went off, mm-hmm. but I can't help well, get David. Guys, yeah, starting. Yeah, David. David out. Right. right. He's starting out. That, that it'd be even better just to call it cute kitten plumbing <laughs> and have a little kitty on, on the side of your truck. Then, then DTH. Then, then TTH. Yeah. Yeah. DTH, even then, though it means something to you, that mean anything doesn't to mean anything to you, uh, to anyone else. Yes. And the brain mm-hmm. is, is in a split second now. Oh, Mark. All right. right. A split second mm-hmm. is having to make a decision. Is this important? If they have to right. figure out what's a DTH, uh, mm-hmm. it's not important. I'm out. Now, right. Mark Vidette just um, said his is MVP plumbing. Right. I, you're out of California, right, Mark? I'm trying to remember. No. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, Mark yeah, Vidette, yeah, yeah. MVP plumbing. We have another MVP plumbing that's on Ju- yeah. Jersey, Pens- or Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Right. That works because it's his initial, but it works because MVP is a thing. Right? Isn't, and, I'm, right. and I'm pretty sure. Most um, valuable player. You yeah. can play off that. The, the mind can pick up on well, what that means. Those right. initials mean something. Exactly. But DTH does not. So, right. Um, yeah, you, you do need to work on that. So mm-hmm. create emotion. Yes. That's what you got to think about. It has nothing to do with plumbing. And they don't have to do anything with plumbing right. at all. At okay? all. And, and make sure that you only work for residential service companies and not new construction. Oh, that's the other thing. And get into the academy. Yeah. <laughs> and you'll learn all this. <laughs> okay, David. All right. So there we okay, have. Yes. So what do we like? Okay. <laughs> we just some, uh, most valuable plumber. Most yes. valuable. Okay. There okay. you go. That, right. that works. Fine. Because okay. M- MVP isn't um, a recognized but, initial. But in the mind, what's happening, mm-hmm. ha- the, the most valuable player mm-hmm. has. Yeah has um, played so much. I mean, that's yeah. that. So the mind is saying, oh, I know what that is. Right. You don't have really to think quick. about it. Right. You can, yeah, your mind will Even though you made it plumber, it. Right. Uh, the mind's really thinking mm-hmm. most valuable player. I'm assuming, Mark, yours is um, like a logo with some sort of MVP-ish something. I'm assuming. Right. I don't know what it is. But anyway. Okay. So there you go. Free advice. David. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. But to um, Point three. always be growing. Well, yes. let's see. Oh. We want to keep moving forward. Yes. Okay. Number one. All right. Number two, mm-hmm. readers are leaders. Mm-hmm. And then point three here mm-hmm. we have up on the screen. All right. Hang with winners. Not whiners. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> Guys, I got to hang with winners, mm-hmm. not whiners. Okay? The problem is, is we've grown up with whiners. Okay? Mm-hmm. If we're in the, the odds are, David, I mean, not to. Oh, let's pick on poor David uh, again. All right. Well, <laughs> odds are, man, we, we come from the same, we're, we're similar. That's why I call, call us brothers. Mm-hmm. Okay? I've, I've seen it all over the world, even. Mm-hmm. Uh, if we're, um, if we're f- found ourselves in the plumbing industry, mm-hmm. Uh, most of us have just kind of fallen into this industry, by the way. No, none of us dreamed of becoming plumbers when we were boys. More than likely and if you, and, and if you say you did, you're either lying or you're, <laughs> you're an anomaly. A, you're, well, you're a sorry case. <laughs> <laughs> okay, because okay? no one wants, right? even after being a plumber, I didn't want to be a plumber. That's why I want to, <laughs> start your own right, and most guys who are successful don't want to be a plumber either. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. We're done with it. But it's been great that yes. we've fallen into this trade because mm-hmm. you really are sitting on the gold mine yes. if you're working for the right customer. Mm-hmm. That's another thing covered in the Success Academy. <laughs> okay. All right. Mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. you want to be, you know, we, we've come from others who have been conditioned to think about 
about life and about money mm -hmm. and about our place in the world a, a certain way, okay? Mm -hmm. Because they, they need us, the robots, the cat, robots, to walk in a certain way. <laughs> what are you talking about? Okay? <laughs> All right? To do their bidding, mm -hmm. to wear their masks. Oh, my gosh. Work there, okay? <laughs> All right? They need us to do that, okay? Mm -hmm. It keeps them in power. All right, and mm -hmm. it makes them money. Okay, mm -hmm. so but to be able to think, mm -hmm. so we've been conditioned a certain way to think. Okay, we need to learn to think like think wealthy. Yes. Okay, and more than to likely, think most like of, a winner. Yes, and most, more, more than likely, most of the people you hang around with don't don't think like that. Um, they are more whiners um, because that's easier, and then they don't. You would think that most of your friends and family really do want to see you succeed, but that's really not the case because then if if you do. What's that reflect on them? Right. 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 They question. It, it goes so at best. It's, oh, I don't want you to get hurt. Right. Don't go out. We're not those kind of people. Right. Ooh, All right. We don't, we don't own companies. Right. Mm -hmm. Remember the, the politician said mm -hmm. those people will take advantage of us. Mm -hmm. Okay. We, we don't do that. Mm -hmm. But let's stay at the safe government job. Right. Okay. Or the factory job. So you okay. get your benefits. So you get your benefits, okay? Mm -hmm. at, that's, that's at best. At worst, it reflects on, well, I don't want, I don't want you know. David to get ahead because mm -hmm. then what's it what's wasn't like, what, 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 right what's my excuse what, right, right exactly mm -hmm. okay so yeah get away gotta we get away from those whiners so there, there's a saying and yes. I think this came from Jim Rohn Jim which Rohn. is another, another good guy Ooh, to, to read Rohn. or listen to um, R-O-H-N I believe right Jim Rohn I think that's right he's one of the first you know that, that's where like the, the Tony Roberts and all learned from mm -hmm. okay yes um, but, like but, positive <laughs> Right, the Get idea of and, right, mm -hmm. putting your mind in the right place. Right. And uh, he had a saying that we are the average of the five people we hang around. Mm -hmm. Think about it, yeah, so which is so it. true. Think so, about who you're hanging around. Right, and if you're the average of those five people. Are they, are they the type that say, oh, it's Monday. Uh, oh, it's hump day. It's, it's hump day. <laughs> We're almost there, so I can quit working now. So really, <laughs> Thursday, Friday, you're not doing any work. Okay. And by Friday, thank God it's Friday. Mm -hmm. And I can go out drinking, partying, whatever. I'm yes. living for the weekend. <laughs> and I spend all day Saturday sitting around, you know, in the cul-de-sac or whatever, or the guys <laughs> drinking beer and talking mm -hmm. about, you know, shooting the whatever. And then griping on Sunday night. All right, sorry. Not looking forward to the next day. Okay. Mm -hmm. And how everyone's out to get, get them and mm -hmm. there just isn't a fair shake. Right. And all, all these so those negative. are the guys you don't want to hang around. You don't want to hang around. Yes. Okay. You because you, oh, right. Go, no, ahead. go ahead. Go well, ahead. Well, you're not, you're not strong enough. Mm -hmm. You know, look, guys, if we had, you know, if there's just one drop of sewage water mm -hmm. in the water, is the water clean or dirty? It's kind of dirty. Mm -hmm. Are you going to drink that? You're going to give it to your kids? Nope. No. Okay. <laughs> because that one little drop, that's how, how things work. Mm -hmm. You know, one bad apple spoils the whole bunch. That's true. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. So it's, you know, it's, you got to be around the clean water. Okay. Yes. You got to get rid of that sewage. And you got to find it. Right. I mean, you got you to find, you got to go and look for people that you want to be around. Well, you never want to be the smartest person in the room. You never want to be the richest person in the room. Uh, most fit person in the room. Right. right? If these are important things, right. Mm -hmm. If you're wanting to, to learn, learn more, you got to be in an environment where you got to put yourself in a place. And this is where we get to being comfortable, being uncomfortable. <laughs> okay. You, this is where it takes, it takes, um, it takes a real man. I'm going to say this because most guys are, I'm not going to hang out with those because I don't like the way they dress. Mm -hmm. I don't like the way to talk. Mm -hmm. Those college boys. They're all what? uppity. Uppity or whatever. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay, all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, that's you're just missing out. You got to put right. yourself. You got if you want if you want to learn some things. You got to put around be around others who are smarter than you. Right. If you want to, if you truly want to be rich, mm -hmm. do you think your buddy you're hanging out with that's working week to week, mm -hmm. you're gonna get you know, gonna learn anything from him, <laughs> making money from him? Probably not. <laughs> right. Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. You need to be around others mm -hmm. who are you know have more money than you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Always, always. Yes. You know, and I mm -hmm. like the, you know, the fit example. This mm -hmm. is I I relate to this even now. What? I mean, we I just said earlier we don't work out at the other place. Mm -hmm. Well, first of all, they're they're all the guys by, by the time they're my age they've let themselves go, mm -hmm. and I don't care how many <laughs> five pound weights they <laughs> <laughs> right. And I and I get at the joints. You mm -hmm. know, mm -hmm. if I if I told myself you know my my the, my, my left my, my left elbow hurts mm -hmm. my. My back. left, my back, my back hurts. My, my, I got, we I got said this that thing. every day. Right. 
If I remind my every day, and of course that's where guys, that's where a lot of people wind up soon. They they get oh well, I got to I'm you know this mm-hmm. is hurting, that's hurting, mm-hmm. and then we let all the weight go and all that. Well, I don't want to work around that. Right. So we joined a club where most everybody's younger. The men are <laughs> yeah. the guys. You know, I got I got these kids that are throwing the weights around, <laughs> but I'm starting to catch up. <laughs> Okay, but I, the reason I am, mm. or even getting close, or even feeling the, the keep up and moving mm. my forward past, you know, the guys that, you know, that look like they're already dead. I know right. guys younger than me already look like they're dead. I know. You know, I know. and they look at these younger guys. It gives you something to work get, with. Right. Mm-hmm. So I want to be around fitter guys. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. I'm not intimidated by that. Right. So you got you got to get rid of the ego stuff right okay mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and be around those who are smarter mm-hmm. you know wealthier right and if you're looking to get fit mm-hmm. right you, you know so there's different organizations you can right. join in and around your community more than likely things like um uh bni which is, there's hit and miss bni business network international is that it well yeah. it's at least a start yeah because start. you get because a lot of times it's just the management and that mm-hmm. kind of stuff yeah. my first thing when i really what i learned this i joined remember i joined that vistage vistage mm-hmm. ceo group for a yeah. million dollars a month <laughs> at the time it was the same with you right? like a million, million dollars, dollars at the time and at the first <laughs> meeting it was like don't I, belong here. I do not belong in this These, room. I don't even know what they're talking about. <laughs> and that was just at the hello. <laughs> you know? And it's like, but uh-huh. out of that, it did right. get me, it stepped me up and started me thinking about stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yep. All right? Yes. And then that's where I met back in the day. They didn't have like this kind of coaching. Mm-hmm. Okay? And that's where I met, you know. The, that's a retired CFO. A, a CFO, chief mm-hmm. financial officer. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yep. You know, it's this old, you know, I'm just this young, you know, white punk. <laughs> and uh, this is this old Jewish guy. And we befriended each other. Mm-hmm. It was the strangest thing. We became friends. And then I right. begged him to teach, teach me you. business. Right. I'll pay you. He didn't need my money. The guy mm-hmm. was a gazillionaire, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. But, I, you know, I paid, you mm-hmm. know. A few grand a month. Yes, and, you, were, you, you put right. yourself in a room where you were were not the smartest person in the room. Right. Yes. And, and you right. So, and so you got to put yourself yeah, in that so situation. Things like that. I mean, even things like your your local chamber and um, Rotary and things like that, where it's just other other um, business people to be around. That's right. What you need to do, and you need to listen to this podcast. So there's that. There we go. <laughs> okay. Food for thought. I hope. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. All right, if you're truly serious, okay, you know. Always be growing. Always be Don't growing. Stop. It never. Because this is your only life. Why not? Know, right. Why not? Right. You know? Right. You don't get a do-over. I'm so there's, sad of people no that do-over. we know, even back, that just have just stopped at doing the same. Mm-hmm. They just, just stop. Mm-hmm. You know, and that's busy dying, mm-hmm. you know. Don't get busy living. Get busy living, mm-hmm. okay? All right. And one way. Right. To live. One way to live, to, to make sure your business here. keeps living. <laughs> there we go. All right. Is the Million Dollar Plumber Success <laughs> Academy. All right. Who, Aaron just made it through. 12 modules. Bite-sized modules. So I broke exciting. it down in modules for you. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Hey, you didn't, learn, you didn't learn plumbing in a day or a month. Okay. Mm-hmm. You're not going to learn business in a day or a month. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, and it takes time. Okay. You got you to um, not only learn these skills, but you, you got to learn to do them well. Right? Yes. Okay. And so... The Academy does that for you, all right? Mm-hmm. Walk you through everything you need to know to have a successful, mm-hmm. self-sustaining is a key word there, mm-hmm. and profitable, very profitable plumbing Profit. business. It's all in there for you. And a 14-day free trial so I can hook you. <laughs> really okay? right in. All right, simply type <laughs> success in the comments or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash success to grab your free trial now. So there we go. Okay. Okay. All right, good stuff there. Yeah, I love it. All right. Next week, part Next five. week. All right, okay. part five. five Join part us. Series. All right, mm-hmm. but before we let you go, as always, I'm going to remind you that you were perfectly and wonderfully created, and you were created to do great things. Mm-hmm. So come like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.